Rated M for Mature. Since the release of Age of Conan in 2008, we haven't rested on our laurels with the game's award-winning visual style. We've been hard at work on our rendering engine, which we call Cheetah, both from the visual and performance perspective, to ensure that we remain at the forefront of what is possible to do on current hardware. This latest update to the game has focused on visually improving the game, regardless of what drivers you run, while maximizing and optimizing the performance so that it scales well across different hardware and driver configurations. The biggest change we made was to move from what is known technically as a forward rendering approach to what the technical folk tell me is called a light pre-pass approach. What does that mean? In practice, this means that we can now render scenes with way more light sources than we had before, with only minimal performance hits. This means that the future content for the game can be made to take full advantage of this new technology and allow our artists to improve upon what is already that award-winning standard for visuals and graphics in Age of Conan. The other major rendering change relate to our shadows. Our new shadow system uses a technique called adaptive shadow mapping, allowing us to really focus the shadow resolution on the areas close to the camera, while only recomputing small sections of the shadow map per frame, which to you and I means we get better quality and better frame rates. The system also features soft shadows, which results in a realistic shadow falloff. And finally, our local lights can now all cast these shadows, potentially resulting in dozens of different light sources casting shadows on screen at the same time, which creates a great dynamic effect. We also improved a lot of the effects we already had, such as god rays and screen space ambient occlusion, making them faster, better looking, and adding cross-platform support to most of them. We have also integrated the new FXAA anti-aliasing, this is a new anti-aliasing technique developed by NVIDIA which provides highly effective edge smoothing based on image luminance variations. It is designed to be extremely compatible with deferred engines by avoiding the issues that traditional MSAA presents with regards to retrieving sub-pixel death buffer samples. Sounds very technical, but in addition what it means is that we get lower video requirements with a great anti-aliasing effect, so still producing those extremely high quality results and avoid the slight image blurring which is common to other image-based anti-aliasing solutions. These are just a few of the changes and improvements that we have pushed out in this new engine update, and we hope that it allows you to continue to enjoy and experience the world of Hyboria like you've never seen it before. <laughs>